What are we looking for? Dogs. What's good, YouTube? This your boy, Burr. You know, we back on Burr's Eye View with it. Like always, appreciate the love and support. Please continue to like, comment, and subscribe. Stop what you're doing. Smash the like button. Smash the subscribe button. Hop in the comment section. Comment whatever you want. Of course, I'm dropping daily bangers day by day. You know we got news of the day coming out of Colorado. And we're going to jump right into it. We got Trent Hood. He's a linebacker, 5'11", 225, out of McDonald, Georgia. He's in that 2024 class, played his high school senior year in the state of Alabama. A physical and athletic linebacker that plays with a lot of fire and intensity, quickly locates the football and make plays, tackles well, displays good play strength as well. His athleticism immediately jumps out on tape. He scored touchdowns on defense, offense, and in special teams as well. He was all state this past season, 7A Alabama Defensive Player of the Year. Of course, he is the brother of Colton and Brandon Hood, who both recently committed to this Colorado football program. Trent was committed to Auburn. Well, now it is official. He's officially committed to this Colorado football program. We now have all three Hood brothers headed to Boulder, Colorado. Of course, shout out to their super athletic family, dog. This is a major blessing, man, to be able to have three young men that are playing Division One football. And of course, like I mentioned in the previous video with his two other brothers, man, they have a super athletic family, man. I mean, they, they got an uncle that played in the NFL. I mean, they got, you know, cousins that played, another brother that played as well, Division One football. So, I mean, super athletic family, man. And again, we got another hood brother headed to Boulder, Colorado. So not gonna keep you long. Just wanna bring you guys another phenomenal update. Please continue to like, comment, and subscribe. You know what time it is, dog. Burr is our view, man.